Hi everyone, welcome to Montana Haven. This is Chloe. <laughs> she wanted to be with me when I talk. So <clears throat> today we are doing something different. We are hosting a mystery dinner for our youth group. And um, what we do is Joas and I, and even the boys helped us uh, write out some riddles about the food that we're serving. And so they don't know what they're getting, but they will be, so they have to figure out, try and figure out what they're getting. Autumn, it's okay, it's okay. And so they might not even get their fork or spoon in the first course. They, so they might have to eat with their, with their mouth or their hands. That would be funny. That's what makes it fun. Anyways, I just wanted to show you and take you along in the process and I'll tell you, I'll show you what I'm doing right now. Okay, here we go. I have some dough rising here and I'll be making them into good, delicious dinner rolls. And here are some brownies that are already made. We'll have ice cream on top with chocolate sauce and um, here is Chloe again. Are you gonna help serve tonight, Chloe? Yeah, you're a big girl. Okay, and also here, I'm gonna show you the meatballs that I had in the freezer. I made them ahead of time. They're, they're elk meat that Joas had killed a year ago, I believe. And also here are potluck potatoes. Now, the only way that I can have a group of people like this with a big family like I have, uh, is by making food ahead of time so that I can just pull it out of the freezer and and make it. So in um, a few minutes, my sister's gonna come. She's gonna help me make some salad and we're gonna go from there and we will show you uh, some more later. Okay, here I have my sister Josie with me and she's helping me cut up the salad Hi. <laughs> Isn't she cute? And also, my mama. Hi. <laughs> it's, it's special having them here helping me, getting everything ready here. Okay, next thing we have to do is we have to hang these sheets all across here so that they can't see what kind of food they're getting. So that's blankets. what we're gonna do right now. So we're gonna hang these blankets to completely block off the kitchen so it's completely secretive. Oh, and I also forgot to mention that it's gonna be a, it's gonna be formal night or they, they also can dress up in costumes if they want. Okay, we're all ready. Um, we're waiting on the people to show up now. We're all dressed in black. We have all have our name tabs on, including mine says dad and mom. And um, we're going to read the menu off, off for you. Okay, Avalon, you want to read the first one? I am fat and black, rich and creamy. I'm white and fat and totally dreamy. And what is that? That is uh, the, the brownies and the ice cream. Okay. Uh, let's see, Ethan's going to read the next one. Justin's going to read the next one. <laughs> I can't tell because they have both have black shirts on, so I have they to look at their name tags. They grow in our gardens from Texas to Rome, a staple of the ages now fed in your, our home. So that's the potluck potatoes? Okay. Yeah. Um, Ethan? I was born in the forest, growing brown and bright green. I come to your table. Don't... Let me say clean. That's a napkin. Okay, where beneficial to most, useless to some. It depends on your status and where you are from. That would be a spoon. In many a battle I've been, throughout the earth I now roam. Used for good and for evil, I've found my way to this home. That is a fork. Oh no, a, a knife, a knife. <laughs> so like in many a battle I've been, that's like a sword. Okay. Um, uh, Justin, you, Ethan, 
or whoever you are. Justin, you can read the next one. Uh, Justin says Justin. Yeah. If you do yoga, you probably love me. If you're up to 300, eating me is the key. That's salad. <laughs> Okay, the next one is candy. It's so chewy and sweet, you'll eat your fill. Your teeth might not like it, but the parasites will. <laughs> okay. I said it's sweet. Next one is mixed vegetables. And that's colors of the rainforest in little chunks of goodness. A drizzle of brown butter gives the taste of fullness. Then we have, on the mountains I ran, so wild and so free. In big blobs of yummy, I now come to thee. That's meatballs. I might be round. I'm, I might be round and roly poly. I know you will enjoy me fully. Oh, that's, those are dinner Jolly rolls. Yeah, yeah. Jolly <laughs> okay, uh, Jolly go ahead. Okay, there Justin wrote this one. I make you energetic and happy with much glee. In my name's a seven, I'm purple as can be. So that's like the, the punch, the grape juice and 7-Up. Yeah. Yeah. Ethan wrote this one. I might be hard to eat at a table anywhere. If you pick me up, you better take great care. And that's the fork. Fork. Okay, so now we're all ready, and we, all we have to left to do is just let the people come. Yeah, and these the children are going to be the servers. Our guests are arriving, and I just wanted to quickly show you. Look at that delicious casserole in there. And... Over here, I've got the meatballs almost ready, and we've got some mixed veggies in here, and the dinner rolls are all done, nicely browned and soft and ready, and yep, the salad, all the, the food over there, and the drinks over here, so gotta go, they're coming in. How we're going to do it is we have a uh, sheet of paper and on the sheet of paper there's 12 items and there's going to be three courses. So what you're going to do is you're going to number the, the items from 1 to 12 and then we're going to serve you four items per serving. So we'll get, we'll serve you four items and you're going to eat for like maybe, I don't know, 15 minutes or, or not eat, kind of like you get. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we have like, I don't know, 16 people here or something. They're hard at work filling out the information. <laughs> don't know what I'm doing. So they're kind of, some of them came in costumes. And others are just dressed up. Okay, here is the first batch of food coming out from the waiters and waitresses. Oh, I did pick it like Thanks, Dolores.